Well, my go-kart project is at the stage where I'm going to cut out the new floor by putting the old floor on the piece of metal and tracing it and scratching it with a screwdriver. There's the frame. I just got done using my welder to make all kinds of little touch-up welds as you can see. It's hard to believe but when I made that thing 32 years ago I never even heard of a MIG welder so even though it's thin walled pipe I stick welded it all together. So after the sand blasting there was little slag inclusions that crap that you can't beat up with a hammer and well now that it was all blasted out I could see holes in my welds so I went and touched them up. Now to cut that thing out and attach that floor to the back and curl it up around there. Got the wood stove on. It's minus 16 out today. It's really cold. Nothing better than a zip cut wheel to cut 1 16th inch steel. I tried using these, but it was just making it wrinkly and it was really hard. This goes through like butter. Done. Hmm. Looks like a perfect fit to me. Now just clamp her on. Two vice grips. Now time to start welding it. I put just a couple tack welds on to hold the floor just to make sure it's all set up right. Now I've got this T-bar thing which is the steering and braking assembly just sitting there not really attached yet ready to weld on. So, a hundred little spot welds later, the floor is attached and every part is securely welded better than it was originally because they didn't have MIG welders in my school back then. Sure wish they did. Looks nice with a shiny new floor. Now it's all ready for prime. It's hard to believe that's not silver paint, that's just raw metal. <laughs>